I almost just dropped my camera. My room is a literal mess. I say this every single time that I film, but I'm leaving for Tortuga Music Festival on Friday morning, and I've been planning this video for a long time, and now that I have like everything that I'm bringing with me, I'm going to do a Tortuga bathing suit slash outfit haul i guess i got a lot of new bikinis but i also didn't want to spend a ton of money some of the stuff that i have is older from like victoria's secret and they're just like simple and then i got shirts or whatever to like make it more fun right i'm just pulling stuff out of my bag i went to a lot of different places to get stuff nasty gal i went to pretty little thing frankie's bikinis amazon some of these are like really well decently priced um others are expensive that I'm paying off because I didn't want to spend like $880 in one purchase so I did the after pay which is my favorite thing right now all right so to start nasty gal I just got my order I got this gingham tie um, tube top and I'm thinking maybe I'll wear it to the ride like our drive down so that when we get to the house we have a pool in our house that we're staying at it's super cool I'm gonna vlog when we get down there but this is just my outfit got this little top that also came with matching bottoms and the bottoms just tie in the front okay so then they just come with this bottoms shorts and it's just a cute little two-piece shebang i tried it on and i was into it but i was like i don't know if i'm actually gonna wear it when we're there sylvia was like no just bring it and like wear it on the way down or bring it so that if we decide we want to like go get breakfast or something like i can wear it in the morning and then the next thing this is actually from a boutique an online boutique i'm pretty sure i'm not it doesn't say it's either from dainty hooligan or it's from amazing lace i'm not sure which and it's this light blue dress with like some frills at the bottom and these right here are cutouts which is kind of annoying because their sticky boobs show when you wear it and then this is completely covered so you can't see like your legs through it or anything really cute i've had this for a while but i'm bringing it just as like a quick cover-up for the pool or whatever we're doing while we're there next thing this is also from nasty gal sorry i don't know why i did them out of order i got a holographic cheetah fanny pack the uh, like entire theme of the trip for me is um is cheetah everything that i'm wearing every day i'm gonna have something cheetah this is one of the things that i've got i bought these sunglasses from fashion nova and they were perfect i love them and they broke like within a week of me having them and nothing happened to them they just broke but i bought another pair because i think they were like six bucks i was putting another order through um fashion nova anyway so i bought another pair and those ones were perfectly fine for again like maybe three or four days then they broke again the exact same way so then i just took my other pair and took the missing piece that kept falling out and putting it into my second pair Within another like three or four days, they were completely broken again. So those glasses need to go, but I got these glasses are very similar to the ones that I got from Fashion Nova. And these ones are um, Nasty Gal, oversized, and I love them for Tortuga because I, I like that they cover a lot of my face. But I'm also bringing another pair of sunglasses with me. I'm going to grab those in a second, Rooney. I have like a bunch of sunglasses, like a lot of sunglasses, and I usually just buy cheap ones. Like I don't think I've ever spent more than like 20 bucks on a pair of sunglasses because I know myself and I know I'll lose them, so there's really no point. I'm really into the tortoise shell. I've always kind of been into the tortoise shell um, style. My dad always wears tortoise shell, so whenever he would wear his wave wayfarers like the ray-ban wayfarers he would always wear them so this is the other pair that i bought from fashion nova that i use my my nasty gals are to replace these there's a, a little piece that's supposed to go right in here and that piece kept breaking off it broke off both ends so now they're literally like you can see how big they are on my face like they don't fit but i really like these a lot and i'm super sad they're broken i want to find something that i can put in there but i know if i put glue it's not gonna i'm not gonna be able to close them anymore so that kind of stinks but yeah i love these but they broke twice in two weeks so 
can't have that. And then another pair that I'm bringing with me to Tortuga are these other tortoise shell. And these ones are from Target and they're just like normal. Um, I think the style name is Erica from Ray-Bans, but these ones are just Target. I think Mossimo, maybe. I've had these for a while and every time I see them, I buy them because they're just like really simple. They're probably better quality than the ones I got from Nasty Yell, but I like them both. So they're both coming with me. Next thing I got, <laughs> my Tortuga band. General admission, because I ain't no bougie. Now it's getting fun. If I can find it. Okay. I just got really scared. The next thing that I got, bikini wise, this is my first first bikini yeah first bikini this one I was obsessed with but I was like I'm not gonna get it because I don't want to spend the money on it I don't have the money to spend on it and then I was convinced so these are from Frankie's bikinis and it's like a high-waisted style but the back isn't super cheeky it's definitely not a thong fits perfect and then this is the bandeau top that I got with it I'm obsessed with it. It's super, super good quality. It's really, really soft. The only thing that kind of stinks is that the size medium fits me well. And I went, I usually get size medium, but since it was a bandeau, I didn't know if I should or not. Just because, like, I didn't want it to be. They said the size up. So I wasn't sure if I should get a large because I have, like, a small around, but, like, it, like, I still have, like, boobs, I guess. So I needed, like, something that was going to be big enough. And this fits well, but every time I bend over, there's like some spillage. So this is gonna be kind of annoying, like having to pull up and stuff. But together, the set is just amazing. Like the color and the way it feels, it's so comfortable. My outfit for one of the days, this set. And then I got this really soft mesh skirt from Pretty Little Thing. And it's open. And then it has just like a tie, so you tie it around your waist. And then I've been wearing it, this is supposed to be the front, but I've been wearing it to the side so that my leg shows through. And I love it with this bathing suit, it's super cute. Only problem is it's huge on me. It's super, super, super long, and I'm too scared to do anything about it because I don't have enough time to get it altered. So I feel like I'm only gonna wear it for like the first half of the day. And then I'll probably end up taking it off. And then for each day, shoe-wise, I'm just going to show you guys these now. I got these on Amazon. So this is my third year going to Tortuga. And every year, I've worn, like, the same pair of flip-flop sandals. But the only thing is, like, they're really cheap. And I think that this could be the year that they break in the sand. So last year, I was kind of thinking that I should get, like, sand shoes. And I just kind of popped into my head one day, like, a couple weeks ago and I was like I should seriously do it and I went on Amazon and I wanted to see what they have and they had cheetah print so of course I got these now the fun part I bought Will a pair too so Will and I are gonna be matching in our cheetah sandals with my cheetah bathing suit and my cheetah fanny pack so this should be fun we're gonna be styling out I'm not sure the brand it doesn't it just they say aqua socks their sizes were kind of weird. So I usually wear an eight and these are seven and a half to eight. Oh no, yeah, it might be seven to eight. I don't remember exactly. For the next actual outfit that I'm wearing to Tortuga, I got these adorable, perfect, seriously so perfect that I bought two pairs, high-waisted um, bikini bottoms from Amazon and the brand that I bought them is Dix Perfect, D-I-X Perfect. They're seriously incredible. They came in a set so I got this in a top. The top and bottom you can't mix sizes so they're both a small because I knew the small bottoms would fit and if I got medium top I didn't think they'd fit any the medium top would fit anyway and I didn't think the bottoms would fit right but here's this the what the top looks like in black because it's a, a set so I did buy two though and I bought this color as well from them super 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 cute but again the top's too small so I'll be getting rid of the top and just keeping the bottom and here's the bottom in like an orangey mustardy color and when I wear this one since we have a pool at our house I'm planning on wearing this one just like hanging out at the pool but if not I do have another outfit that I might be able to wear that together 
so we'll just have to wait and see. So this, um, with these black Dix Perfect bottoms, I'm wearing that with, like I said, I'm not buying all my bathing suits because I didn't need to. Just this black neck adjustable string top from Victoria's Secret. It's really flattering on me. That's why I was like, I'm fine with wearing it because it's like a style that I actually really like. It's not one of those styles that really goes out. I'm wearing the all black with this top. It's a beat. It's like a beach day top specifically because it's really uh, thin material, really lightweight. And I'm wearing this with my all black outfit. I think this is going to be my favorite one because what I have been doing is tying it up right under my boobs and it looks like a little... A little, a little swim, fun swim thingy. A little action like this. Well, obviously this will be like tucked in with my bikini and I thought it was super cute. And then I might wear it off the shoulder cause it's gonna get hot and then just wear it like, like this or whatever. So that's my second day outfit. The next one is what I'm still undecided on so I probably won't know what I'm actually gonna do in the last day of Tortuga or the day that I decide I'm gonna wear this. So this is where I went a little crazy. I bought this top. It's from Misguided and I kind of am in love with it. I love the colors. I think it's really fun and vibrant. It's just one of those that you tie in the front. Clearly that's like the theme. However, very tight on my arms. Like very, very, very tight and not comfortable. I think that if I'm getting sweaty, I'm not gonna wanna wear this. I was gonna wear this with more bottoms from Amazon, shocker. Again, I don't know the brand, but I'll link it. These purple bottoms, super cute. And then it came with this purple top, which actually fits. And they're both size small and really good material. It came with the boob pads in it too. But I also got these bottoms from Pretty Little Thing. This was the first pair that I bought. Super unflattering, thin material, not good quality at all. I'm not, I don't think I'm going to wear these, but they were cheap, so I didn't return them. So I think I'm just going to hold on to them or sell them, resell them, whatever. It literally has, has the liner still in them. They just weren't for me. Since this top didn't work out to my expectations, I'm still bringing it just in case I want to, like, maybe take a couple pictures in it and then take it off and, like, live my life the rest of the day. I also got this white, like, off-the-shoulder another tie front top and this one will be great for Tortuga because it has the holes in it so I can wear it and I won't get too hot so another one that you can wear off the shoulder and just tie it right in the middle I love it it doesn't look that cute right now but I think it'll be really great for like the actual event because I feel airy and at night you do get a little chilly because you're on the beach so this is like one of the most exciting things that I have other than my Frankie's bikini which I spent a lot of money on anyways love this really excited about this thinking what I might do is put these together with I have just a just like that black top that I showed I have a white top like the same style and I was thinking I'll wear that with this or if I don't want to wear strapless because I don't want to be pulling it up I can wear this with my white right now I'm just like I'll just play it by ear and like see how it goes like when we get there and how I'm feeling in it the next bikinis that I have I didn't buy well this one I did this bikini I bought from Zahara Swim I have a code for like 40% off I think I love this bikini I ran into an issue with the company and um, I forgave them for it because they I did like a swim mix and match because I knew I needed a different size top and bottom so I got the medium top and the small bottom the first package that they sent me was a medium top and a large bottom and I was like hey, I can't wear this, like, that's not the size I ordered, and I'm not going to pay, like, $25 to ship it back and then pay for another bikini. So I was just asking them if they could send me the right size bottom, I can keep the top. Thank God they did. They sent me a new bottom and a new top, which was awesome, and, like, I really didn't need that, but they did it, and I was really excited. So now I have this bikini in a, the right size, and I have it in a size up. So I think Rachel's wearing this. She tried it on, and she really liked it. And the bottoms are high waisted as well. These bottoms are the size large, but you get the you get the oop wrong way. You get the gist of it. Obviously, the other ones are smaller, but they're actually really nice cut. The first year I went, I used the flash tattoos, and they did like a super good job. I thought they were really fun and exciting. So I bought some more this year. I got some last year too, but 
This time I got them from Wish. I thought about it like super ahead of time and it's way cheaper to get anything from Wish. So I got a bunch of different styles of them. I think these ones are the ones I'm gonna use. The moons like right down my spine. I thought that'd be super cute. And some silver. That's cute too. I think Sylvia would use that because she's getting her hair did. Let me talk about one other thing that I'm bringing with me to Tortuga. This is the Maybelline Bronze Dream Bronze BB Cream and it has SPF 25 in it, in it and I've been using this for the longest time. I just found out that it was discontinued which I thought had happened because I hadn't seen it anywhere but I also hadn't been like actively searching. I only looked when I went to Target. This has been discontinued and I need something that does the exact same thing that this does. This is really dark but it blends out really nice and it'll give you a really good glow on your skin and like you can see that it's it's like pretty dark on on the lid and I'm about to run out and I need a replacement of this I don't know what I'm gonna do if I can't find it because I need it but if you know something that's like bronzing and like a BB cream I saw some at Ulta today that were like $55 which is ridiculous because that was $9 when I bought it so just please if you have something let me know because that's like my go-to for the summer I don't like wearing matte foundation it makes me look really gross during the summer at least like I I don't want to wear a full face. This is a one-piece bikini that I got last year for spring break. Really cute. I have actually a picture of me over here wearing it, but you can't see it. And I got this from the Copper Closet in uh, the Avenues Mall in Jacksonville, but they have a Copper Closet location in Orlando now, too. They have a few different locations. And then I also got these bottoms from the Copper Closet. They're really, like, thongy, so I'm not sure if I'll wear them. But I love the color. And I thought I could wear these with this top from Forever 21. They match pretty well. I kind of just love the colors of this top, too. Like, it's not the most functional top because it's, like, a bra strap. If that makes sense so it's not super like supportive or anything because it's just got like the you know the normal straps but I did wear this last year to Tortuga and I loved it when I was tan it was super cute so I'm bringing this again for the pool another bikini that is like an all-time favorite that I have to bring one because Rachel's gonna wear it and two because it's just like one of the best tops that I own I got this from Tilly's and it's full tilt and it X's in the back which is my favorite style of top because I think it gives you the most support. You can kind of tell it kind of crosses in the back. It's a little something messed up, but you get the point. And that's from Full Tilt. Got it at Tilly's and it was cheap. It was like 15 bucks probably for the top. Another swimming top for the pool, also from Forever 21. Also, I don't wear, I'm not gonna wear it to Tortuga because it's not supportive enough and I'll not be comfy. Another top, crosses in the back that seems to have been discontinued i can't find it anywhere really disappointing it's my favorite bathing suit I, I mean maybe not my favorite but like it's definitely up there as a favorite this one is by body glove it's bright red and i usually since i didn't buy the bottoms that go with it i'll usually wear it with red high-waisted bottoms from amazon sorry there's something in my eye it's just itchy i have a few more bathing suits these are all basics same style as my black top, black bikini top from Victoria's Secret. Adjustable sides, really comfortable, another really flattering top. I figured I could wear that with black bottoms or mix and match, do something fun like neon. These are the itsy bitsy bikini bottoms from Victoria's Secret that were really popular when thong bathing suits first came out and were like becoming a thing. And I bought a bunch and a bunch of different colors and I still love the like whole neon look. So I wanted to wear that with this top. I actually got this top from Forever 21. Super, super good quality. It's like almost a, a um, body glove top that ties in the front, but it doesn't have the ties in the front. And it's adjustable. It has like nice padding, but it's not like cups. Like it's not thick. And like this part isn't like it's flexible. This, this is like a good top. Like I'm trying to figure out from this angle, you can kind of see that it like curves. So it's got like a good spot for your for your boobie just to like sit in. And then another like pinky, corally, itsy bitsy, itty bitty, something like that. Bikini bottom. The top that matches with that. Another just like my other ones. This one's actually a triangle. My other ones were like more of a scoop. Last one, best one. Another Victoria's Secret triangle bikini top. Also, you probably think I'm crazy for bringing this many for three days, but I'll probably wear one bikini in the morning 
when we're at the house and we're in the pool and then I'll change so really I need six bikinis I'm bringing a bunch just in case like Sylvia or Rachel want to wear them last I have the Maui babe after browning lotion and this is their lotion and this stuff smells so good Mmm, she's nice. So I'm gonna bring both of those too. That's all I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed looking at what I spent my money on for the last three months because I, oh my gosh, my jewelry. Got it. So I went to Forever 21 and I got a couple necklaces. First one I got was this one and then this one, which also has like the little diamondies. So we've got like the little jewels here, one at the bottom and then cute. You guys are gonna see everything again in my tutor tutorial, tutorga. Tortuga vlog. So pretty. Tortuga 2019, baby. Just do it. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.